Hey guys, this is Casey from Android Central and we're going to give you a tour of how to purchase paid apps on Android Market. Um, it's a relatively new feature so I'm going to give you a walkthrough and see if there are any paid applications. Um, there's a nice little section that I didn't notice before but it's the demo section. It's great because now you can test out applications. We're not going to download a demo but I'll just show you a quick um, walkthrough of it. Uh, as you can see there's the paid application of Hello World for $4.99 and Paid applications just pop up like this. I would rather prefer a, a section dedicated to paid applications. But anyways, we're going to take a look and probably buy um, Guitar Hero because it's probably the biggest name in Android market right now. So do a quick search of Guitar Hero and there it is, $9.99. A little pricey, but if the game is good, I mean, I'm sure it'll be worth it. Um, there's a description. It's basically everything. And then the reviews come up again. The reviews don't look so hot right now, but we're going to take a closer look and give you a full-on review of Guitar Hero after this. Um, everything's the same, it's just like um, buying free applications to give you what the application has access to and so forth. Everything else about the process is the same except Google Checkout comes out. It's already linked to my Gmail account for the G1 so it's pretty free and easy to do. Um, it says the purchase cannot be refunded but that's because I messed up and had an expired credit card at first but now you just press it but and usually you can refund in a 24-hour uh, window. So now my order is complete. I could just check the, the progress of the download in the notification window. Um, I'm connected to a Wi-Fi network, so it should be relatively fast. After you download an app, a paid app, uh, I should say, they send you a confirmation email um, so you can confirm your download from Google Checkout. Um, we're going to fast forward in time a little bit because you don't need to see the download and the installation process because everything's the same as regular apps and we'll just jump in right into playing the game. So everything finished like expected. We didn't run into any hiccups. Um, let's try to find Guitar Hero then, yeah? So let's click the Guitar Hero. You get the um, hands-on mobile, Activision, all that good stuff. And let's try to see what the gameplay is like. Ask for sound on. Yes, I mean, why would you play Guitar Hero without sound? <laughs> um, I guess we had to set up an account, it looks like. Oh, uh, look at that. They have a soft shirt type esque keyboard. Not really sure if we like it, but um, we'll just jump around. And here we go. Here's Here is Guitar Hero on Android. I'm on ease right now, so I shouldn't struggle so much. But stay tuned for our full review of Guitar Hero coming in a week or so and then yeah go and download paid apps in android market and come back and tell us how it went